In this tutorial, we're going to talk about the Geometry Browser and some of the features that are available to you over here in VSP. If you click on this drop-down, you can see that you have a lot of prepackaged components that come with VSP that we'll get into the details of later. For right now, let's just try and add a pod to the wing. Now you'll notice that this shows that the pod is a child of the wing by this little indented section here. If we click on wing, it collapses it, and this plus sign indicates that this component has children attached to it. So, if we decide that maybe we didn't really mean to add that in, we can either cut the component out or we can delete it. It's good practice to use cut just as your default action because if you remove it and then realize that maybe you didn't mean to do that or you removed it by accident, you can simply click and paste and it comes right back. If you click delete, it disappears forever and you can't get it back. So another thing that you can do is you can copy, click on wing and paste, and that'll put them in the same level or you can paste again, and it makes this a child of the previous component. So you can copy components very quickly using this paste key. Now if we go under the Edit Menu button, you can see that we have our usual hotkeys and shortcuts for these actions. Cut, copy, and paste using Control X, C, and V. You can also select all using Control A, and you can use Pick Mode. Now Pick Mode, if we turn that on, lets you pre-highlight components inside the workspace, and then it highlights it for you over here in the model tree and brings up its geometry window. So once we've done that, you'll notice that it hasn't turned off yet. You either have to choose P again, or turn pick on and off here or here. For right now, let's go ahead and select all of these using either control click, shift, or click and drag to highlight multiple components, and let's cut those out. And now we're back to our basic model. We can also select all and choose that we can no-show those components. We can click on the wing and show a single component, or we can click on a component and show only. Now notice, I clicked show only on the fuselage, but the entire fuselage group is now shown. That means that everything under this component comes along with it. So if I want those to go away, I have to no-show, and it treats those as a group. Now we have only the fuselage. 